the family was uh, referred to me by their uh, 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 GP, by their physician, because uh, the family had noted that there was a problem with several of the males, including the son of the lady who was referred to my uh, clinic. And I, um, I talked to her on one afternoon, and she told me that the problem uh, lay with her son and several of her brothers who had uh, the same problem. And she wanted to know whether her daughters, wh who were then approximately 14 and 15 years of age, whether they might be carriers for this genetic uh, thing that afflicted the family. But at the time she asked a question of us, there really was no test to be done. Based on the pedigree, it was clear that it was inherited and the family had known this for a long time. And it was also clear that it was very particular that it was only transmitted by females and only the males were affected. So we were quite sure that it might, if it was genetic, it was going to be on the X chromosome, but there was no test. So um, I then discussed with uh, this lady and her family uh, that we might want to start a scientific project to try and find out if we could define the gene that causes this.